Welcome to NerdStalker. I am Adolfo Fronda at NerdStalker on Twitter, and uh, my guest today is... Hi, this is Gleb Budman. I'm CEO and co-founder of Backblaze. Hey, Gleb. Um, so, uh, Backblaze, what are, you, what are you guys doing here on NerdStalker today? <laughs> so, we're, we're chatting about World Backup Day. It's coming up this Saturday on March 31st. And it was a great event that was uh, started by some Redditors who were concerned about people losing data. Oh, you know, I saw the site, and it looks like there's a lot of people. Uh, uh, they have a whole countdown clock down to the day, and uh, there's a lot of sponsors that seem involved. It seems like you guys are one of the premier sort of sponsors, and, and there seems to be a lot of, like, buzz about this thing. So uh, what's, the, what's the message with this, uh, with the backup day? Well, so the idea is obviously everyone should be backing up every day, but people don't. Uh, only about 6% of people actually back up on a regular basis. Hmm. And so it's just a day to, to get people to remember, let's get those computers backed up. So if you're, if you're a geek, help your friends back up if you're already backing up. If you're, um, if you're uh, not backing up, back up yourself. Um, if you've got a blog, share it with people and tell people to, to get their stuff backed up. So it's just a day of everyone trying to get their backups done, set up backups if they have them, test their backups if they have them, etc. Awesome. And so, um, and, and so is there any sort of, what, what do we do on this uh, uh, backup day site? It's just informational or what's up with that? Yeah, so the worldbackupday.com site is informational. It's a place that you can send people to to remember uh, and learn. There's uh, some information about different ways to back up, if you want to back up online, if you want to back up to an external hard drive, mm. uh, ways to check your backups. There's also some giveaways and sweepstakes that, that different sponsors are doing, giving away hard drives, giving away uh, subscriptions, giving away some free storage, um, mm. discounts, etc. Very uh, cool. So it's a it's a way of doing all of that, um, and uh, and I hear rumors that there's going to be even be a little game um, that you can play on on the site as well. Oh, awesome! So why how um, how are you guys sort of like connected to this whole thing? So we obviously have cared about people losing data for years. We started Backblaze about five years ago to focus on getting every single person to back up all of their data. So uh, last year, when uh, World Backup Day started the first time, they reached out to us and said, hey, can you guys sponsor and give us some, uh, some free licenses? So we participated and, and helped out with a little bit of awareness last year. This year, we actually became the presenting sponsor of the event. Oh, wow. So we are, uh, we're uh, giving away 10 free licenses. Excellent. And, uh, and we're giving away a new iPad. Oh, wow. Uh, so all you have to do is, is give the service a try. Simply install the free trial of Backblaze at backblaze.com. Mm -hmm. And it's super simple. You enter an email and a password, click download, no credit card or anything else required to enter the trial. Cool. And ran randomly pick someone uh, to win the iPad, and we'll randomly pick 10 people to get a free one-year subscription. Cool. So, um, you know, just full disclosure here, we are customers of Backblaze. Uh, we are not uh, affiliated with them in any monetized way, but we do always... Uh, Definitely recommend them all the time um, to, to everyone. Um, Gleb, could you tell us about, uh, you know, what is Backblaze? Is it like um, a local hard drive connected to my machine that I back up to that you guys, physical product you guys sell? Is it a cloud-based thing? Is it a server solution or what? Sure. It's a cloud-based thing. So what we do is we install a little tiny piece of software on your computer, whether it's Mac or PC. And then we automatically grab all of the data off of it, and we send it over the internet to our cloud, to our servers, mm -hmm. and we're just continuously backing up the data. So we provide unlimited storage. Mm -hmm. It's five bucks a month. Wow. We just back up continuously, mm -hmm. and the data is all fully encrypted. It's compressed, so we're very efficient on your system. You don't have to pick and choose files and folders. We just grab all of the data except for your OS and your apps and it's all just stored in the cloud. If anything ever happens, if you lose a single file or your entire machine dies, you can come to our website and pick specific individual files, folders, or just grab all of your data back. Wow. So I, I saw some sometimes back, you guys were offering like some sort of plans for servers or something like that that you guys had open sourced or something. Can you touch on that? Is that happening anymore? Sure. 
Yeah, so we, uh, in order to be able to afford an unlimited online backup service for five bucks a month, mm -hmm. we actually have to build our own cloud storage. And that cloud storage is about 30 times less expensive than what Amazon S3 charges. Wow. So it's a very, very efficient cloud storage service. Now, we don't offer that as raw storage. We just use that to provide this unlimited online backup service. Mm -hmm. But as part of that, we had to actually design our own servers. And so there are these massive uh, 45 hard drive, 135 terabyte storage servers. Uh -huh. And we, we built them and we've been using them for uh, about four years now. And a couple years ago, we decided to share the design with the community. Wow. So we open sourced the server design, the actual hardware, and we published an update to it uh, about a year ago and we'll be hmm. publishing another update to it later this year. And uh, hundreds of companies uh, and organizations use it to store uh, all of their data. Wow, no kidding. Awesome. Yeah, and, and it costs uh, it costs about eight to 10 grand to build one. Wow. Um, and there are even some companies that will build one for you. Wow, that's incredibly affordable for that kind of requirement. So what's, uh, what's the go forward for uh, Backblaze? What do you guys got going on? That you can touch on. So yeah, so we're working on a lot of things. Uh, so that we've got some uh, mobile app uh, development going on. Wow. Um, we're starting with iOS, uh, and then we'll we'll do uh, Android and, and likely an HTML5 client um, that'll uh, enable you to get uh, better access to your data. Um, we've got uh, a number of projects around trying to make the service even more efficient and faster mm -hmm. on your system. And the service is available both for individual consumers and also for businesses. Hmm. And on the business side of things, it's still a flat uh, rate, still unlimited storage. It's still 50 bucks a year for unlimited storage on a per computer basis. Wow. Um, we've got some uh, additional things we're going to be working on there to um, flesh out the uh, reporting and management um, for, for that experience. Very cool. Incredibly so, affordable. That's uh, quite a, a value add there. So it seems it looks like uh, what has the team grown and where are you guys located now? Yeah, so we used to be in Palo Alto and yeah. we outgrew that space, so we moved up to San Mateo. Oh wow! And so we're in downtown San Mateo. There's uh, about fifteen of us uh, now, mm -hmm. um, so still very very lean, very very efficient, um, profitable, um, uh, um, still bootstrapped at this point, mm -hmm. um, and just growing quickly. We grew about. Uh, uh, two hundred percent year over year, mm -hmm. uh, and hoping to do that again this year. Wow! So, are you guys hiring, and what kind of people are you looking for? We are actually. So, um, we're going to be looking for uh, uh, additional data center help, um, both uh, senior and junior. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, we're, we're starting to look for a PR person, mm -hmm. um, and uh, we're looking for support uh, help. Um, and someone in, in a finance accounting tech role. Awesome. Wow, you weren't kidding. You guys really are growing. <laughs> <laughs> so World Backup Day, when is it, when is this happening? So uh, World Backup Day is this Saturday. It's March 31st. Um, it's, uh, yeah, people can go to the worldbackupday.com site for information. They can also visit our site, backboys.com slash worldbackupday for information. Um, yeah, install some uh, install free trial on your machine. Start getting it all backed up. Um, that'll enter you into uh, sweepstakes for various things. And if you already are doing backup, awesome. Get it double checked. Um, we uh, uh, we recommend obviously doing backup online. Uh, so if you're backing up to an external hard drive, that's a great start. Mm -hmm. um, but uh, you you want something off site as well as uh, local. Mm -hmm. Uh, and then uh, just one thing to, to mention also, so one of the things that we added uh, last year was locate my computer. Oh, so wow. So if you lose or have your computer stolen, not only can you get your data back, but we'll actually help you find your computer itself. And wow. We'll help the people do that as well. Oh, that's cool. Very cool. So if we want to get additional information, how do we, how do we contact you or Backblaze? Yeah, just the, the best way is uh, backblaze.com slash worldbackupday. There's information there. You can also check out our blog, uh, blog.backblaze.com. 
Uh, we're on Twitter and Facebook and Google Plus. Um, so twitter.com slash backblaze, facebook.com slash backblaze, Google Plus, uh, search for backblaze. And we're pretty active on all of those if you want to come chat with us. Cool. And you guys can contact me at uh, Adolfo at nerdstalker.com and at nerdstalker on Twitter. Uh, or go to nerdstalker.com, period. <laughs> and you can find more information there. So, uh, Gleb, thanks so much for your time. Great to talk to you again, man. Great talking to you, too. All right. See ya.